for um, Best Supporting Actress in a Play for Abigail's Party. And we're now joined by Will Young. I thought you were giving out to me. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Great Abigail's party, loved it. Um, did you love it? Did you see it? No, I didn't. Oh, you didn't. No, I didn't. No. Congratulations, I love though. The play. Amazing play. Congratulations for uh, Cabaret. That's Thank pretty you. exciting, isn't it? Yeah, very exciting. And it's your and it's your first musical role, I believe, in the West End. First musical role. Yeah. So pretty pleased to get that. It must have been, it must, I mean, it's a big role, it's an intense role, it must have been quite an a intimidating experience starting that rehearsal process. It wasn't actually, because the, the um, whole cast and Rufus and everyone was so welcoming, you know, and they were really free to say, you know, if you need a hand with this or that, so it wasn't, it was anything but intimidating, you know, as, as it could have been, um, but everyone was so friendly, you know. And your choreographer, Javier de Frutoth, Javier. is, uh, he's known for uh, being very, quite uh, quite an intense rehearsal style and quite uh, quite incredible choreography. How is it to yeah, be work, working with him? Well, it's sad, I actually thought the choreography might be nominated, because it's astounding, you know, I've been lucky to work with a few choreographers over the years and I just think his choreography is right up there. It's so different and interesting and it's so much easier to do you know the same thing and also because it, I mean it was sort of a revival but it was really kind of a brand new show in a way and he really reinvented the Corrie again you know everyone was great yeah and the lifestyle of doing uh, eight shows a week or whatever how did you take to that well I quite like the routine because in pop there isn't any routine you know so you never know what you're doing I never know what I'm doing so it, when I entered into the, the musical I knew that for the next five months I'd be that would be it, eight shows a week, you know, have most of my days free and evenings not free. And hasn't it given you, given you a taste for musical theatre? Are you going to be, be pursuing other roles in the theatre? Yeah, not for a while, I think. And what's really nice and very fortunate that I can, you know, do my singing, pop singing and songwriting. And then and when I finish an acting job, I always, he's telling you to, to wind up. Um, so I'm going to monologue now for three minutes. 